going into Halloween themed episode for season 30 of ABC's Dancing with the Stars, it was a tight competition all round. The stars are here. Hello couch potatoes, welcome to today's video. This recap is all about recapping only my favorites. So if your favorite is not my favorite, sorry. The first performance of the night is a Paso Doble from Mike the Miz and Whitney Carson. They performed their Hellraiser inspired dance to Wicked Games and right off the bat, their costumes are out of control and spot on. Lin wants the Miz that he has to work on his posture, he thought the Miz nailed it and that the dance was a good mix of aggression and expression and he seemed to like it overall. The rest of the judges agreed. Derek praised the pro wrestler for really getting into character with the routine and Bruno compliments Mike on his footwork. They received a 9 from Kerry Ann, an 8 from Lynn, 9 from Derek and an 8 from Bruno and they got a total of 34 out of 40. Melora and Autumn are the next pair to take the floor. This week they do a jive to Hound Dog and it's inspired by Kujo. The judges also really like this performance especially when it comes to Melora's acting and playing characters. Unfortunately it's not all the judges favorites. Well it's one of my favorites. Kerry Ann said that Melora needed to give us more when dancing. I want you to push yourself. It was a little safe. Added Kerry Ann. Derek agrees with the sentiment while Len says it was a great quality and quantity for a jive dance. They received an 8 from Kerry Ann, a 9 from Len, an 8 from Derek and a 9 from Bruno, putting them at 38 out of 40. Two couples got perfect scores, Jojo and Jenna and Iman and Danielle. Despite a night of amazing performances, there unfortunately still has to be an elimination. At the end of the night, Tara announced the couples who were safe. I started feeling anxious about Melora and Autumn, but they were the final couple safe from elimination. That meant the bottom two of the night were Kenya and Brandon and Suni and Sasha. The judges were unanimous to keep Suni and Sasha so Kenya and Brandon had to say goodbye. Did you enjoy Horror Night? Who was your favorite? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Until next time, thank you for watching. Hey, Couch Potato, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you soon.